Welcome to my very first Let's Play! Yay! I finally made it! Uh, this is Pippa Funnel's Ranch Rescue and I've decided to start with this one because I don't think you can find a Let's Play on this which is kinda sad because this is a pretty good game. It has its small flaws but it's good, I it's enjoyable. Uh, first of all I wanna say that I have no idea how you can find this game. Uh, it is... I want to say pretty old. Uh, I, I was surprised that it's actually worked on my computer. That is pretty new because you know old game doesn't tend to work nowadays. But if you want to find it just google the name and you will probably come to some site that ha where you can buy it. I would not recommend to uh, download it illegally because that's illegal. I don't want to go to prison so yeah. Uh, so that's that! Uh, I hope you're gonna enjoy this. Uh, as you saw the first uh, small video, it's a pretty beautiful world we're gonna be in. And there are gonna be a few parts where I'm going to clip, because like taking care of horses and stuff. You've seen it once, you don't want to see it again. So yeah, uh, you know what? Let's just start this let's play and you're gonna see the game and I hope you're gonna love it. Just like I am! Let's do this! Spacebar. Uh, yeah, yeah, whatever. So, new adventure, load adventure options, and exit game. So, uh, I don't think I need to do anything here. Yeah, new adventure. <gasps> uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. That's this one is empty. Box free. And ooh, ooh, yes, we have a horse. It's a mare. And I was thinking. Uh, I was thinking in my let's play if I'm going to be able to name my character it's going to be Rose just like me but we can't name our uh, main character in this uh, in this game so but we can name all the horses so I figured that our first mare's name could be Rose instead so yeah our first horse name is Rose yeah is Rose I is this name okay yeah it's great it's gonna do this a lot, I'm gonna tell you. Oh. So yeah, ooh, let's start. It's gonna be a few movie clips, so I'm gonna shut up now. Fire! Huh? <laughs> what? Where? Where? <laughs> come on, come give me a hand. The horses would rather you take care of them. Okay, uh, okay, I'll be right there. So, that was the first clip. Yes, we're going to go and speak to Uncle Dylan in this stable. Uh, oh, right. Uh, you can move with the arrow keys. You cannot move with... Yeah, as you can see. Use the arrow keys to move. We're moving. And she can pretty much only run. If you want to walk, you press uh, shift and she will walk. And then we have all the chicken. And yes, they do run away when you run after them. And we have a cute little doggy here. Hello, doggy. You're adorable. Um. Yeah, we have a few instructions here, but anyway. Uh, in here is the stable, and we're gonna talk to our uncle. Our uncle, who we apparently live with. Uh, 
is Uncle Dylan and he's wondering where we were. We were sleeping on the couch. Yes, we were sleeping on the couch. Uh, I had uh, thoughts of actually doing uh, voice impressions on this and read them to you, but because of all the movie clips that is going to happen, I pretty much thought that it would be annoying to have one voice for when I do it and then a completely other voice acting for when it's the movie, small movie clip. So I'm, I'm going to skip that for this. But basically, uh, we're sorry. Um, she was so tired yesterday that she fell asleep on the couch. What? Yesterday. Oh, oh well. Uh, space bar. Um, yes, we did go for a long ride with Rose and did not notice how the time passed. So what? It's true. He caught us. God damn it. Uh, she couldn't resist. Okay, but come home earlier in the future. He gets worried when we're out so late. Aren't we a grown girl? I don't know. Don't worry! Uh, yeah, the horse is very safe. Rose is very safe. If you did not know, we can see Rose right there in the corner. I have no idea why I'm pointing at the screen. You cannot see it! Uh, uh, which reminds me, I want to go back over the techniques for steering your horse today. Right, let's go! <laughs> There is going to be a lot of loading screen as you see, but they are fairly quick. Yes. Let's take a few step and as of course we have the arrow keys for that. So, uh, and yes, she says huh, when she wants to go forward. It's quite funny. And we can turn left. Yes, the animation not the prettiest when it comes to the sword. I it's fine. I mean, it's not like Star Stable Online kind of animation. And this is how we break. But if you did not know what Star Stable Online is, I'm so sorry. Uh, but I I'll I'll come back to that for you. Um, so we're going back. So as you can see, arrow keys, uh, slow down with the down key, and then if you want to uh, make a total break, press shift. Uh, so yes. Uh, so we're going back. Going back, we're pretty much on. Oh, right, this is how you do. <laughs> I have a tendency Ooh. to uh, press the wrong buttons because I'm so used to using the WASD for doing that. Yes, we are so good at riding. You let us out alone. I mean, we should know how to ride by then. Uh, yeah, we're going to do not only take care of our horse, we are going to break it in in this game. Uh, apparently, she doesn't know how to say break in. Breaking in a horse is the first step involved in the training it. Doing this will strengthen your bond with Rose. There are several ways to break in a horse, personally. I only believe in one. Uh, the inventor of this method was a great horse riding champion. You know the man I've already spoken to you about. Grant! It's a man we're gonna meet. That's him! He completed uh, completely re Revolve... okay, I don't know. Revolve... I have a bit... yeah, whatever. Let's skip that word. The way to we communicate with horses, I have enormous respect for him. Great. So I notice you never stop talking about him. That's annoying. <laughs> In my opinion... Uh, the no, sorry. In my opinion, he's still the greatest horse riding champion ever. But let's get back to today's exercise. Building trust. On the stables board, you will find information about each horse, including its name, breed, skills, and if it's uh, been broken in or not. It's important to check the info on your horses and you train it. Uh, by looking at Rose's file, we can see that she hasn't been broken in yet. Oh no! Now let's go and see Rose. She's waiting for us in, this, in her box. Wait a minute. We were out riding her yesterday, but she hasn't been broken in yet. That breaking in yet. Um, that's just, it's, uh, it's a lot of small plot holes here and there. Just bear with me. It's fine, I guess. So, let's start with a breaking in. Uh, building trust. We have trust issues. Yes, we have this and they are going to explain it again soon. Basically, what we are going to do is, uh, 
is that we are going to pet the horses in the right spots, as it says, in the right order. If you skip, it's gonna, it's go you're going to lose trust. Yes, it's a game. Awesome, isn't it? <laughs> Two, three. So, we have a hand here. It's very sensitive. And we pet here. And then the butt. And then here. Yay! When you get when you pet Rose like you're supposed to, you can see her stress level falling. She was so stressed before. So the back, and then here, and then here. It's a bit. Oh, I missed it. Apparently, sorry. <laughs> it's a bit of a memory game. Uh, here, and then here, and the butt. Everyone loves a pet on the butt. Pet on the butt. Congratulations! We have built trust with Rose. How did we ride outside the ranch with her before this? It's just so weird. So, so weird. So, well done. I can tell you're going to get a great... Get on great together. I need to actually read what I'm going to say. It's true that she looks calmer. That's a very effective technique. Okay. You're beginning to understand why I admire Grant. Uh, now we need to look after Rose to make her feel better. I'll show you what you have to do. Uh, there are four aspects to looking after your horse. Uh, brushing it, washing it, picking out its hooves and cleaning out its box. You must uh, perform these tasks as regularly as possible. Uh, a horse that is well cared for will be more likely to do as you ask. Do you mean that Rose won't listen to me if I don't look after her? Well, duh. <laughs> Absolutely! If you don't take care of your horse, Rose's morale will be low and you will have problems training her. <laughs> but you'll see, looking after a horse is great fun. Don't forget, always give your horse the respect and care it needs to remain in good health. This is important. Do you understand? Yes, Uncle Dylan! Yes, sir! Yes! <laughs> So let's start taking care of our. Ho okay, it does this sometimes. It's okay. Uh, we're going to take care. Here is Rose's box, and then we go to horse care. And I'm pretty much gonna show you all of these, and then after when I have to redo them, I'm not gonna <laughs> show you because th it's just not fun. I mean, it's not fun doing them repeatedly for myself. So I guess it's not that fun for you to see them repeatedly all the time. So yeah, it's gonna be a lot of clipping after this episode when it comes to this. Uh, so yeah, apparently we're gonna wash her. And when we're washing her, they're going, they're, mice are gonna appear and she's gonna get scared and dirty again. So, uh, but when I've done this, I've done it so quickly that the mice hasn't really had the chance to scare her. <laughs> but if you look closely, mice should be up here. Oh, there she, there it is. There is a mice. Uh, da, da, da. Uh, uh, if you want, you can make the mice go away by wash by <laughs> washing them with the with the water. Oh, and as you can see, uh, the tank of water is going down. You refill it with your right mice mouse button. But now we're done. <laughs> Quick and easy, really easy. Uh, yes, yes, and we get a star. As you can see, it's filling up. Uh, up there. Yes, we're gonna brush. Uh, it's not like the washing. Uh, you will see that it's like itching at some point, and you have to brush at the right spot uh, on each side side for it to be great. Uh, do 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 do. So here you see this. It's itching, and then it's itching up here. So, and you switch side by uh, clicking the right mouse button, and we have something here on the stomach, and then here in the belly, no, not belly, leg, and she's done! Very good, yes, thank you! And we get another star for her moral, and then we're gonna do this mocking, I love this, this uh, cleaning the box, because usually you have to pick up the poop, throw it away, pick up the poop, throw it away and then refill it. This one is fairly easy. You have... Uh, you just wash it away. It's really easy. I mean, you just do this. And it's so clean. It's so clean. It's cleaning. All the poops goes away. I have no idea where it's going, but it's going somewhere. 
And oh, and it's clean. Uh, we don't refill it with hay, but I can imagine that we are s we that that it's been refilled with hay. That she doesn't sleep on the stone floor. Otherwise, that would be actually animal cruelty. Now for my favorite, not. It's the picking hooves part. All four of the hooves have to be picked, of course. And we have to be careful not to be picking at the star sort of. They explain this free time, it's so annoying. And yes, this takes uh, this time. So you keep. And it does that. Don't uh, scratch the middle part, as you can see. And then it will hurt her, and she won't be happy with that. So just remove this. Scratch, 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 scratch. Ooh, big part. Scratch. <gasps> Next. <laughs> it's so nice of her to just lift her own hooves. Hold up. I mean, no horse does that. And the bigger the horse, the heavier the hoof. So much fun. I have actually cleaned a pair of uh, the smallest hooves that you can ever find on a Falabella. He was so cute. And it's so small. It's like. You just do this and this. Oh, yeah, right. I did it. Sorry. Um, and and it, he was done. <laughs> it was done. Four hooves done. Uh, perfect. She's clean. So, yes. What's happening now? <gasps> loading, loading. Congratulations on the job you do you did with Rose. Now she is in great shape and her moral is excellent. Horses are animals that need a lot of care and attention. That's why you need to remember to always look after them well. And don't forget that you can check your horse's moral at any time by looking at its information file. Oh, it's the phone! But you know what? We actually have to stop here. Because this is the first episode. And so, in the next episode, we're gonna see who's calling! So, I'll see you next time. Bye! <laughs>